Hey guys, it's Lainey, and today is going to be my 1,000 subscriber video. I never would have thought that I started booktubing in the beginning of August, and here we are in the beginning of December, and I have over 1,000 subscribers. It's just, it can put, it's completely incredible. I can't believe it. I didn't, I just, no. Since joining booktube, every single day, I shit you not, has felt like Christmas morning. To wake up, to pull out my phone, and to see all my notifications from when I was asleep of subscribers and activity on my videos it's just it just makes me so happy it puts me in such a great mood for the rest of the day that I'm interacting with everybody here and uh, people enjoy my videos and it's just it's just great and I want to thank each and every one of you guys for subscribing to me and just watching my videos now for my 1,000 subscriber video, I thought I would do a shout out video of all the people that I've been watching like a lot and people have connected with because I know how important it is to give shout outs to other people because people gave shout outs to me when I was first starting and that's how I gained a lot of viewership of course. We're such a great community where we give back to each other all the time and mention each other and tag each other and tag a bunch of people. I've always been appreciative when people tag me, people mention me, so, and I always try to do that as well. I'm always mentioning people, I'm always tagging people, and now I just want to do a really good sh shout out video. The first person I'm shouting out is Mindy from Mindy Reads. Uh, she started booktubing right around the same time I started booktubing. She commented on my videos and I commented on hers, and then we just kind of uh, kept corresponding with each other, and of course she is first person that joined my top five Wednesday videos. I like her style and books because she does read young adult but then she also branches out and she reads a lot of Stephen King, she reads a lot of horror, she reads a lot of um, other mainstream adult fiction which uh, I really like because I'm getting more ideas to branch out myself and reading other books that maybe I wouldn't have picked up before. The next person I'm shouting out is Christine from She's a Gift who also started booktubing around the same time I did and we actually found out that we kind of live like the town over from each other. We live like seriously like really close together which is crazy that this booktube community is the way it is. She also takes a, like a scholarly approach to some of the books she reads, especially some of like the historical fiction that I wouldn't have picked up but I enjoy watching them because it's always nice to get um, her perspective in different um, reviews. I think she's a great reviewer. Next person I am shouting out is Sam and Monse from We Fangirl It. They have made me want to read Vampire Academy so bad. Like I haven't picked it up yet but their obsession with it has made me want to read that series so much. I really like their chemistry together, uh, I like watching their reviews, their tags, and the way they play off each other is just great. The next person I am shouting out is Miranda from Books 101. This girl, she is so energetic. I love her personality and the way she talks about books. I remember when I was first like just starting out, like seriously only had like probably less than 50 subscribers and I tagged her in the birthday book tag. I was just so nervous to tag someone who had clearly a lot more subscribers than I did but I did anyway and when she did it and she gave me a shout out and I was getting all these like notifications on my phone of so and so has subscribed to you, so and so has subscribed to you, and so and so has subscribed to you. Some of her subscribers of course were starting to subscribe to me and I couldn't believe it. I was so excited and she has mentioned me a lot of other times in her videos and she mentioned me in one of her shout out videos which I adore because that's such a great way to use your uh, popularity in the booktube community to uh, promote other booktubers which I think is so so great and like that's what I'm gonna start trying to do more than I already have been because Seriously, a simple shout out really does go a long way, and I love that about everybody who gives other people shout outs. The next person I am shouting out is Jacqueline from JBookLover13. Seriously, one, not only is she gorgeous because her hair and her makeup are flawless every time she does a video, and I am so jealous. I love her taste in books. We have pretty similar tastes as well when it comes to dystopian. 
I like her insight and her, the way she talks about books as well. And I see it. She has a cutout, a life-size cutout of PETA, so I'm like extremely jealous of that. The next one I am shouting out is Becky from Books and Pain. Becky, she is my ginger homegirl. She's one of the international um, booktubers that um, I've really enjoyed watching. We also have really similar tastes in books. We fangirled so hard over The Darkest Minds that I can't, I can't even, it just makes me want to fangirl even more. And um, I also really enjoy her videos and her the way she does her tags and everything like that. I just saw on Instagram that she just dyed her hair brown, so you, she's still my ginger homegirl, but she's currently a brunette. The next person I am shouting out is Chloe from The Book Lover. I subscribed to Chloe when I saw that she was obsessed with the Sweep series by Kate Tiernan, because that book, those that series was my junior high school experience, I swear, like those were the books that were part of my adolescence. So when I saw that she was obsessed with those books just as much as I was, I subscribed to her right away. She's also the first person that tags me in a video ever, and that was her original book tag, the birthday book tag, which you should check out and you should do because it was a ton of fun. The next person I'm talking about is Kayla from Bookadoodles. We, we, we are the same person. I knew I was gonna like this girl so hard when she, I saw in a video she mentioned Peter Petrelli from Heroes, she also mentioned Chuck Bass from Gossip Girl, and she loves Troy probably more than I do, and we both agree that Brad Pitt as Achilles is butter on bread. We also have a very similar taste in books. She really hoped that I would enjoy Under the Never Sky by Veronica Rossi, and we all know how that has turned out. I am obsessed with these books so much that I have called them crack cocaine and heroin. I love her videos. She has come up with some amazing original tags and I think everybody in the booktube community completely loves her. She's just so personable and uh, really genuine. The next person I'm shouting out is Jillian from Bookish and Nerdy. When I see she uploads a video, it's Literally, I stop everything I'm doing and I watch it. Her Stacking the Shelves videos are my favorite videos to watch ever. I love to see the new books she gets because I'm always writing at least five down on my own list of books I need to get. She also has joined my Top 5 Wednesday series. The next one I'm shouting out is Suna from Kiwi Lover 25 She messaged me and she said how much she enjoyed my videos and um, I subscribed back of course and um, I started watching a lot of her videos and we also have really similar taste. She makes me want to read vampire books more because she also had this video of vampire book recommendations which I really enjoyed watching, which is great the way she talks about books. She's also adorable and I just love watching her videos. I am shouting out is Eileen from Eileen Reads who is my other ginger homegirl. We also have crazy similar taste in books and not only dystopian YA but and also like contemporary. I love watching her hauls, I love watching her reviews and her tags. She's just great. She's so cute to watch and you guys should go check her out. And the last person I am shouting out is Shannon from Cozy Tea Reads. One, her hair is freaking fabulous and that her hair is what my hair looks like when I don't straighten it but it looks great on her and looks ratchet on me. Everybody, I feel like, loves Shannon. Her personality is so contagious, and she's hilarious on Twitter. When I'm doing this video, which is Saturday, she has messaged me her love for Under the Never Sky, which she started reading. She loves it, and I'm glad I didn't overhype it for her, and yes, so I love Shannon as well. All of the booktubers I have mentioned are gonna be in the links down below. I hope you subscribe to them. They're just great people and people I really enjoyed watching. I hope you guys all have a great day and I will see you guys later. Bye!